elements of a communication system. Let us briefly go through this simple process of transmitting information from a source to a destination. A dance program, for example, conducted at an auditorium is being recorded by a camera. The dance program is our information signal. The voice and the visuals are converted into electrical pulses by the camera. These are then processed and converted into a form that can be transmitted by the transmitting tower. The transmitter sends this signal through the channel, which is our atmosphere in this case. The TV set, the receiver, reconverts the radio waves into audio and visual signals. These waves can also be received by many other users. Let us see how the different stages of the communication system from the block diagram point of view. Here, the information source, the dance program, is converted into a message signal using the antenna and is then sent to the transmitter. The transmitter sends this signal through the channel, which is our atmosphere, in this case. These waves are received by the receiver and are then converted into the desired waves for the user. Sometimes, noise in the channel interferes with the transmitted signal and causes distortion. This is the basic block diagram of a communication system. In the example that we just saw, the information is sent to many users across the city. Such communication is called broadcast mode. The other type of communication is point-to-point -point communication. If you talk to a friend over the phone, it is point-to-point -point communication. This mode is called point-to-point -point because it is a link between a single transmitter and a single receiver.